caught something. I jagged into that corpo's biomod. But no, no raw virus, so need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling, my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Go on some threads, meet me downstairs. Take a shower. Bench. Full seam, okay. So how do we look again? Where did my hair go again? Okay. That's a bit strange. Yeah, character. Let's see character. Yeah, much better. That's much better. I don't like those sneakers though. Those are much nicer. That looks hella fun, but no. Let's, let's just move with this one. Do we have anything for the face? No, we have these though. Hell no, bruh. Anyways, uh, we're gonna select a weapon as well. I see. We got a scope. Nice. Anyways, let's go. Let's move on with the mission. Uh, we've done goofed one too many times. Can we just put that? Hey, what is it? Regina Jones here. If you're looking for 
you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How'd you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, V. One second. Can we unequip? There we go. Hey V, Regina Jones here. I heard you're looking for work in Watson. Just so it happens, I'm one of its main employers. If you don't want to waste those talents of yours, check the gigs I sent you. Do good work and there's more where that came from. I'll be in touch. Yeah, I don't know. Um. Life is good. Ain't it? Oof. Oh, hey there. I mean, they're just probably like, you know. Meet with Jackie. I will as soon as I, you know. Is that you? How you like my new punching bag? Just gave me a next gen ass whooping. He did. <laughs> Be curious to see how he handles the likes of me. <laughs> so, how about it? Where'd you get him? How's it, How's it going? The fight's about to start. Not gonna watch, take notes. Malone versus Hernandez. <laughs> nah. Our chrome friend here don't watch TV. Don't talk neither. Only way he communicates is with them fists. That's so. Where'd you get him, Fred? Off the street. Saw him looking up at me with these big sad eyes. So I took the poor pup in. Fed him, clothed him. That's nice. <laughs> nah, for real. He's a military bot. Got a sweet deal. And a tumor mine tossed in a few upgrades. Now, here we are. Is that so? Nah, I'm also gonna today. say not Thank today because. Work. Whatever. I'll be here. You'll be. I don't know. Because this is again an open world game. Uh. What? What if I told you that I could have some fun and make a little eddies in a single stroke? Fighting tournaments coming up, I think you've got what it takes, flicking on the cords of your opponents. Money and fames are waiting. Oh, and one more thing, until the lockdown on Watson is lifted, you won't fight in any other districts. But don't worry, when things loosen up, you'll be the first to know. Alright, a couple of words about who you're gaining up against. Baku won't spoil this, just come and see. Our Royal Buck, 6th Street Ganger, real piece of shit. Clan, Caesar, fists like fucking hammers. Uh, Animals Club, Rhino, Woman's Legends, lays flat. Okay. Anyways. And Tons. I guess. Oh. Uh, what are we doing again? We're supposed to meet with Jackie up there. Or is it down here? Oh, it's down here. Good. Good, good, good. We miss Jackie. It looks so futuristic, too, you know? Cyberpunk. And in an exciting development, even I don't care. Cyber Psycho was a tank on two chrome legs. The fuck were you thinking? 
There's a reason Vat's pack existed. Yeah, I don't know about those two. The SCPD will pay you to help fight crime. Geeks fixers will contact when approach your gig's location. Fixers leave some remains will inform you about local gigs. Okay, amazing. What? You uh lost your work. Okay. Let's just go and talk to Jackie. Man of the hour. Jeez, <laughs> took you long enough. Worked up an appetite, just waiting. Sit down, let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. This is something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right, or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J-O-B. Job? Oh I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Sounds fun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 cool. pounds of get some snacks. Plated cool. Tell me more about Dex. Deshaun. What's the latest spec on him? I know you got info to spill. He's been off the grid for about two years. Word on the street was took a little vacay. Okay. Years. Vacation. Okay. Uh, not a vacation. What is he up to? Uh, guessing he shoved pizzas in his mouth while jerking off to hardcore virtues. <laughs> the important thing is he's back. Got a fresh crew. He found us. How'd you manage to pull this? Trading your spleen or something? As far as I know, we're not the type to get fingered by Dex. You know me? Oh. But Debug, he's the one that hooked us up. Got us talking. Knew it was a done deal the moment he laid eyes on me. Come on. Ain't nobody who can resist this. Am I right? Facts, bro. <laughs> Whatever you say. So what's the gig? You meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself. Face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, this whole deal, he's riding on. Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back. And my face is yesterday's news. All Dex says he needs to check you. Talk to him. Sounds fun. Look, B, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Okay. Guess I got no choice then. Dex is the real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't okay. get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is gonna lose his own. Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gong to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit. Hit the nail on the head, B. <laughs> get out, Samuel. Or you know. Stuff like your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over after our uh, scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Okay. Some top notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's, Let's go. Factory new ride. Let's try this new car. Woohoo, boy. First well, let's stop. go. Ripper Dock. And Holmes. Easy on the gas, huh? Or just days. I was supposed to stop by Vix anyhow. I got a date. The SCP. You don't say. She's so sweet. Really gets me. Let's go. Let's see what they got for us. Oh, 
my goodness, bro. We done killed a person. Let's just go. That didn't happen. Are you coming? Just kill a person. Did you see that? You know, nobody saw that. Yeah, this is it. Come on, V. Find me once Nick's done done. We'll hash out what Dexter's cooked up for us. See ya, man. Hey, V. Dr. Vector will see you now. Oh, hella sweet, though. Like, I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. Can I do the catching up and please? Cause I am always makes me easy for them and not fun. <laughs> we found something. I was like, pet the woman? What the fuck? But it's a cat. Let's pet the kitty again. Let's pet her kitty. <laughs> Sounds so wrong. Uh, we don't want to go over there. Let's go chub. Just, just straight to chub, you know. To a common practice, however, why your installation is still dangerous, it is can perform by qualified specialist reaper dogs. Uh, these are several reaper dogs burning through Night City. Who offer a variety of different cyberware upgrades. Vicky's fries every old ripper. Good to see you. Good to see you too, V. Been a while. So what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neurosocket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Old kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Met a new fixer. He gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshaun. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But something you're not telling me, Vic? Keep your guard up, that's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. Right. Need some new kit, but it's tools, not toys, Vic. It's time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean. Hitting the major leagues. Just need tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. So let me guess. That sounded like somebody Hasn't was having yet. some pain. We actually pay that much? We don't have the money. Exactly. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time, you hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. They're gonna strap me up, Doc. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now, Jack in. Kuroshi? Whoa, Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Hmm, sounds like it could come in handy then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this. Might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. Fine. Let's go. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. Turning implants are mechanical replacements for the organic parts of your body. They can give you superhuman-like abilities, which can improve your combat comp capabilities and help you survive in hazardous conditions. Also, a common practice in 2077, they also initial uh, invasive and sometimes dangerous medical procedure. Go 
OK. That's a thousand bucks. Come on, bro. We need lots of money. Need to upgrade a lot of stuff in us, you Mark know. one, like I said, it's a decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. This talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. You sure about that, Doug? I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. What are you going to do, Phil? Lay that major league arm of yours right here. So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine with me. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day, I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town. I've been sleeping nights ever since. Let's just place the arm. Let's see what just happens. Like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Play by play, though. Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. <laughs> Lights out for a minute, all right? Okay. Goodness, bro. He's swapping our eyes. This ain't even a joke. Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Oh my god. How's it look? Feel all right to you? Better than ever. Oh, this is fantastic, Dick. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Thanks. Provides you a lot of useful information. Okay. Look at the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. Database of wanted persons. Okay. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Thanks, you Doc. Weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new site. What about the virus? What about the neurovirus from the last job? Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. <laughs> Thanks, Vic. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. What's that? What am I looking at? A mild stim. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Okay. 
Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once oh, you hit well. the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. Don't worry, Doc. I got you. Who's winning? Hernandez. You know, in the old days, that cripple Malone would have been flat on the boards. Now every last fighter's got extra skull on him. Absorb 75% of every blow. You bet on this fight? Cash right now, miss. Nah, I'm just looking. <laughs> it's out of habit more than anything else. Miss, miss it? it, don't you? Ah. Uh, I'm just gonna move, you know. Oh, her pussy's gone. I mean, her kitty. Wait, what did she say? Uh, did she say hola? Avoid mean reds. V, and yo, listen up. I'm sorry for dropping you, honey. <laughs> Keep talking, it was interesting. For you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked. Next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. I can zoom in. How's biz, Misty? Booming. Hmm. You're the first person to walk in here for two days. And two days ago, it was a pizza guy got lost oh people in this town they've lost their spiritual connection but well you know I'm here to serve them not the other way around true um yeah I guess we're meeting with Dex V listen I've got this delicate matter That's okay why I called you the number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise now that's probably not news to you but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. How's it going? There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Their mechanical eyes have resisted the temptation to be right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Mag Tech hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. Uh, gotcha. Fog, bro. Hmm. Okay, now lethal, now lethal, now lethal, and EMP. If given weapon combat gadget, uh, okay, it will be mentioned in description. Okay, gotcha. So what? I'm 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 not that good, okay? Let's be honest. Oh, you want me to get in? I thought we're gonna talk through the window. I'm sorry. Guess I'm getting fucked. Yo, Mr. V, a pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh, ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. Okay, T Pain looking ass, right brother. Plane. Would you rather live in peace as Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? Mm, this is some sort of test, Mr. Nobody's done. How to remember it, that's all that counts. It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager supple youth. Respect. Can we see your mouth move? Thank you. Um, alright. Listen close. Okay. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scab home. Hang on. I got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? 
Could have had Jack here at T-Bug City. Could have just done this on comp. Call me old-fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Mm -hmm. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past, and sweet T-Bug helped his brother out three years ago. So here we are. Mm -hmm. Besides all that, got a special little pre-mission just for you. But we'll get to that. Mm -hmm. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype test. A bioship to be precise. Job to grab it. Simple. Yeah. Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Not at all. Corps don't deserve special treatment. Yeah, <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of it. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Need to act to resolve him fast. Second, the rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anchor. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Okay. Klein, tell me about her. Klein, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Bet knew it wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Okay. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much been keeping. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beat? Plotting the charge. Okay. I got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a military convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Okay. Now see, Convoy was carrying the Flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Rick. I say went, because Rick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gang mate, one Simon Randall, a.k.a. Royce, plain dropped his ass. Mm -hmm. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aimed to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith's doubt of Militech has developed an interest in said combo. Royce guy. What's he like? A straight psychopath. Chrome loving kind. Big club in this town. I'll give you that. Except few of its other members. No matter the stakes, would put a friend and associate through an industrial microwave dryer. Apparently, first thing to burst are the eyeballs. Get a nice clear pop. Then the rest goes goulash. Okay, Who's I guess we're in goulash. Corpo agent. Internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. So on lead, she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. I like your eyes, bro, when you send shit. I think I got it. They glow blue. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lucy's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. Gotcha, Mister. One more thing, Mister B. Yeah. Quiet life or blaze of glory. Hmm. Later now. Okay. Guess we're getting out. Performing certain actions will reward you with street cred. 
Build your screen cred to make a name for yourself in the Night City Underworld. Doing so will open a new opportunities. Dexter, talk to Dex. <laughs> I want to want to check our pro cred. But to me, it feels more like he tangled us up with Maelstrom and Militech. Mm -hmm. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clepped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. Right, right. Heard about that. Voice versus Frick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agents, too, but I don't know how much help she stands to That's be. That's a nice car. Don't sound thrilled. Royce, what do you know about him? He's fucking whack, something special. Junkie snort junk. Royce snorts chrome. Then there's the other Woo, thing. I almost got hit. The client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. Must know what he's doing. So, how you want to play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Hmm. 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 Do we gotta go with a client or do we go with Maelstrom? Let's start with the client. I think I ought to see her first. See what she's like. What she's after. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Okay, buddy. Hasta luego. Mr. V, I just want to remind you again that Eddies have already changed hands between me and my estimated Maelstrom partners in this. Around sum of 10,000 euros dollars to be precise. So when you're there to take it off their hands, don't let them try to shake you down. As they're liable to do. Maelstrom being Maelstrom. Thanks for the info. You'll need that. Best of luck. Amazing. Uh, it's 2 a.m. This is a dream you're dreaming. You're not in the mood? Good for you, buddy. I mean, the game's looking awesome so far. Except the, the only thing that I don't like is like we're sitting at 32, 33. We're going between 30 and 35 FPS, which is not the satisfying, I would say, because I was expecting quite a bit more, to be honest. I was expecting like maybe 40 ish, 50 ish FPS. Come down, I'm moving. Regina? V, got a rat problem on my block. Who doesn't, right? Thing is, these rats are human sized. Look just like tiger claws, too. Biggest one is a certain Taki Kenmochi. So do your fixer a solid and neutralize her ass, will ya? Deeds attached. Gotcha. Okay. Kick the gun for hire, target, Taki Kenmochi, residence building at Cortez. 
Details I gotta place at this block at Kabuki or Kabuki. Not many know about it. Welcome to the club, and I prefer to keep it that way. Problem is a certain tiger cunt and friends set up a pa pachinko operation right in fucking doorstep. Could mean trouble for me down the road. Let me guess. You think it's better to hide in plain sight? Yeah, fuck that. When it not if the NFCPD cracks down on those pachinko machines, I know they're gonna poke. Their ugly pig noses right around in my backyard. Can't raise them seeing something they should. We can't sit in this. Head to the residential block where a tiger by the name of Taki Kenshimoto is running this pachinko show. Deal with her. Any other tigers in the area will get the message and peace and quick. Gotcha. Hmm. Those guys could be in trouble. I just pushed the shit out of that woman. Okay. Okay. I got. I got slapped by a car. That's the first. We're closed right now. Right. Between 6 p.m. and 6 a.m. Gotcha. Are you a woman taking a piss while rain? While standing? That I mean me. I get it, you might be she male, but goodness. War is coming. I feel it. Oh, you feel it. Good. You're feeling it. Nice. Anyways, I'm gonna leave this episode right here. Hope you enjoyed the video. Drop a like if you didn't dislike this video. And of course, subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys in the next part of Cyberpunk, if there is. Pretty sure there will be. Bye.